everybody. My name is Robert Hanna. I also go by Robbie. I'm a fourth year PharmD MBA student at Virginia Commonwealth University. I currently hold the position of National Student Officer of Professional Affairs with IPHO. So I'm going to talk to you a little bit about my interest in industry and why I'm trying to pursue a career in industry. Um, so it all starts with my passion. So I'm a person who's very passionate about making um, impact or having impact on, on my patients. I, I do everything with passion and to, to empower my patients, to have them um, understand what's happening with them and take care of, uh, take a better care uh, of themselves. So I've been working in, or I've worked in retail for over six years. Um, I've volunteered in, in the pharmacist-led ambulatory care clinic for two years. I made huge impacts on my patients that, you know, they tell me like, thank you doc, like now I understand what's happening with me and how to better take care of myself. However, I felt like I wanted to impact even more people because what's, you know, you can probably see 50 patients max, like uh, that's probably it and that's like a very, uh, very like optimistically speaking. Uh, but in my head, I felt like I want to impact more people. And then I start thinking about it. I was like, well, let me go to the root of it. So what is the root of it? Pharmaceutical industry. They are the ones who have an impact on millions and tens and even hundreds of millions of people. Um, I might not have that direct face-to-face -face interaction with the patient, but I still am making an even bigger impact on their lives. Um, and I feel this is our call and specifically my call as a pharmacist. I'm there to make changes and make impact in people's lives to actually have them, um, you know, have better care and better um, health. So um, what did I do to get there and or, or still am doing to get there? So first of all, uh, leadership positions. I, again, I've been the president of my chapter. Now I'm a national student officer. I held other chapters, uh, sorry, I held other positions in some other chapters um, in my school as well. Um, I also did research, so I did some bench lab, uh, you know, research and I also did some uh, managerial aspect of research. Um, and this is, this is why I feel like my MBA with my PharmD, this is going to be like where my passion is going to be translated into action. I am interested in the commercialization aspect of the industry, uh, business development, marketing, business strategies, which makes sense because I'm using both of my um, degrees to, to that, to, you know, to the max of their uh, scope. Um, IPHO has played a very integral role in where I am today. So again, my leadership, I've also done the VIP case competition for like two years. Um, I have the pleasure and the opportunity to work with Jim Alexander, who is the founder of IPHO on a personal level. He gives me advice. He, you know, tells me what I could do better, what I, you know, I should keep doing and things I, you know, I shouldn't even do. Um, so having this mentorship or that, you know, one-on-one -on -one relationship is, is very important to me. Also, Jerry Silverman. Um, he, he has those beautiful CV seminars that like I attended one I believe a month or so ago and I'm pretty sure some of you watching me probably have to it was like over three or four hundred students who saw that or attended that it, it, it affected my CV drastically I took so I had so much advice in that that it was beautiful um, another thing that IPHO helps with professional development is their website so I'm a P4 I'm about to start thinking about and preparing for uh, mid-year and fellowships. So the website has this beautiful fellowship catalog. Where else would you get that? Everything in one place, you know, at least the brochures, who to reach out to, everything. So this is, this saves a lot of time, especially with somebody who's doing another degree and on rotations, and I need to do this and prepare for everything. Um, so basically IPHO again has been, you know, if you're a P1 watching or P2, P3, I encourage you, it's never too late, I encourage you to become a member just because it will help you so much, it will cut so many steps on, in, in your way and it will take you places that you, you know, that will probably lead you to a better career in the future. Thank you so much for listening to this. Uh, 
please feel free to connect to me on LinkedIn. My name is Robert Hanna.